Rich, what's the atmosphere been like in the camp for, for Floyd's camp this time? It's been hectic, man. You know, every day the gym's packed um, and everybody is, you know, everybody's holding their breath. Nobody knows really what's going to happen. Um, I mean, a lot of people are sure Floyd, Floyd's going to win, but it's the, it's the uncertainty of what Connor's going to do in that ring, which has got people, you know, excited, worried, uh, talking. You know, nobody really knows how this fight's going to play out. Um, and that's why I believe it's going to, you know, the num numbers wise, it's going to do even more than Pacquiao because, uh, you know, the hype, the, uh, you know, the theater, you know, I was at these press conferences, man, it's crazy. Like, you know, the, they were filling out arenas for press conferences. So this is unheard of. You know, this is literally, this is like a once in a lifetime fight right here. And it's, uh, you know, it's been an honor to be a part of, you know, the last stretch of his training camp. The rumours, as per every Floyd Mayweather fight, is that he um, was put down in sparring by Zab Judah. Uh, first of all, what have you seen of his sparring in his preparation? And did you see Zab Judah land the shot that put him over? I didn't see that, and I highly doubt that that even happened. Um, you know, stories, this is what happens. You've got a big fight, and, and any, anybody will say anything to just you know, get a little bit of limelight or just add to the, add to the occasion. Um, from what I've seen, Floyd is in tremendous shape. Um, you know, I, I watched him train for Maidana, I watched him train for Pacquiao, and I watched him train for McGregor. And in my opinion, he's in he's in just as good shape as he was for those for those opponents. So he's not taking the fight lightly. Conor hasn't had a fight uh, in the professional ranks as a boxer, but uh, Floyd is treating this fight like you know he's about to go in there with you know the number one contender. Um, so I expect there to be some serious action on the night. What happens? Who wins? You know, I can I can only say I can only say that Floyd uh, is going to be victorious just because we have no we have nothing to base uh, Connor's boxing abilities on. We don't know what he is, um, and we know that Floyd is one of the best ever. So you can't really you can't really you can't really say that. Connor's got much of a chance of winning. Obviously, anything can happen, but um, you know, if you're a betting man, you, you, the smart money is on Floyd.